Hey everyone, thank you for tuning in and watching my video. Today we're going to be uh, taking 32 gigs of RAM, that's four sticks of eight gigs, and updating my MacBook Pro. Uh, the slot is right underneath the display panel. And uh, what you're going to need is a Phillips screwdriver to uh, remove the door and access the uh, RAM tray. When we look beyond our next meal, our next post, the everyday choices of everyday people are facing the storms and curing diseases. Now, once you remove the door, there are four little RAM uh, slots. Uh, what you first have to do is pull out the uh, ribbons here and these actually pull the uh, RAM right out of the, uh, the sockets. There's one click and there's two clicks. Now from a different angle you can see the ribbon uh, better. Uh, once you pull them out the RAM just slides right out. Uh, it's no longer locked in the slot. And uh, take note of the, of the position uh, when removing the uh, existing RAM. Okay, so now we're ready to install the new RAM into the uh, into the iMac. Um, I have to admit, it was uh, a bit tight uh, getting a couple of the modules in. Um, <laughs> it may end up hurting your uh, tips of your fingers, um, but uh, make sure you do have them in the correct position. And uh, all it takes is just a, a push, and they snap right in. Um, as you can see by the video, I'm able to get the one on bottom first, and then, uh, and then I got the one on top. Um, but, but like I said, it's a bit, it's a bit tight. Uh, it can be tight, but if you're just gentle enough and uh, firm, uh, you should get the, uh, you should get all uh, four modules in, or depending how many or you use your modules you do have, you should be able to get them in no problem from here on in. Okay, with all the modules in now, you can tuck away the ribbon back inside uh, the uh, iMac. And um, we can begin by uh, replacing the cover and screwing uh, the screws back into place. Okay, so now we are going to power the, uh, the, the Mac iMac back on. Um, cross your fingers for luck as we uh, boot the machine up. And uh, now comes the moment of truth. What I'm going to do is uh, we're going to get the information uh, of the iMac and then I'm going to post a couple screenshots just to see, uh, just to confirm that the iMac is uh, detecting the 32 gigs of RAM that uh, we've installed today. And there it is, 32, 32 gigs at uh, 1333 megahertz. All four slots with eight gigs in it. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.